Channel Journal. I'm here with Liz at Monter at in Silver City. And what's going on today, Liz? We're doing our Easter for thousands. We're packing 5,000 boxes for uh, churches and organizations to pass out to, the, to those who need food. And how many years have you, uh, Monter, been doing this in Silver City? In Silver City, it's been three years. Three years. Three years. All right, so you got 10,000 boxes for Thanksgiving, five for Easter. So that's 15 times three. So that comes out to how many boxes over three? 45,000. 45,000. All right. So let's just quickly walk through the line. They get the boxes over here. They slide them down the line. All right. They open them up. Open them up. We've got frozen chicken roasters that are going in the box. Now, when you say, what, 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 what exactly is a roaster? Oh, there's a roaster. So they get a whole roaster. They get a whole roaster. A whole roaster. Whole roaster. All right. Then you get. Moving down the line, you got applesauce. You got peas and carrots. You got corn. You got yams. You got brownie mix for a great dessert. You get a gravy mix to go with your chicken chicken roaster. So you've been doing this for three years, so you've got this system worked out pretty much where it's... It's it's just continuous and it rocks on and it gets faster and more controlled chaos every year. Controlled chaos. It's so much fun. We have, we have um, employees from our first processing and our second processing. They love to mix it up and see who's fastest. All right. Then we got community members that roll in and come in and they, they come from all over. And they just, it's just a community fun event where we all come together to help those in Siler City and surrounding counties. We've got organizations from Chatham, from Randolph, from Alamance, from uh, Lee County, and some from Wake. So this covers a lot of territory for those in need. I know I've asked you this question already, but I'm going to ask you again because I think it's an important question. Why is this so important to Monterre? This is so important so that we can show the love and we can show that we are neighbors with our families. Great. All right, so, we're, and you got, is that yams in there too? We got yams too. Oh my goodness, all right. And there's your brownie mix over there. Yep. All right, and I assume the brownie mix Mashed has potatoes. instructions on. Mashed potatoes. Mashed potatoes. All right. When they finish packing the boxes, they shut them close, they put them on a pallet, and after that, the pallets go over here to the, all these wonderful organizations and they pack them up and move them out. Yeah, and I, and I noticed you mentioned you have volunteers. I noticed you have the Sheriff's Department out there. Uh, you also, before this thing started out, you had safety. Uh, your safety manager talk about the safety rules. I noticed just about everyone who's walking anywhere near vehicles has got a safety vest on. That's right. So, Goal Zero is super important to us. We want you to leave the same way that you came in because you got to get back to your family, you got to get back to your kids, and you got to get back to your community. So I got to come back with all my parts then. That's right. All right. Anything else we need to know, Liz? We love this event. We love being a part of our community. We want you to come and help at Thanksgiving and be a part of this fun and excitement. All right. Thank you so much, Liz. Folks, we're here at Montaire Farms for. Meals for thousands for Easter. 5,000 boxes are being picked up that will be able to feed 20,000 people.